Well, summertime heat is here, and it is more important than ever to check your back seat. WJTV 12's Jalen Anderson reports that it should be number one on your list when you exit your vehicle. Temperatures can reach triple digits this summer, especially when you factor in the heat index. That's why you don't want to make a possible deadly mistake of leaving a child, loved one, or pet in a hot car. Temperatures in non-moving cars can be 15 to 20 degrees higher than a moving vehicle. Experts say that leaving reminders in the front seat can prevent a tragedy. Make sure you have a small toy that you can put in the front seat as a reminder for the uh, driver when they get out of the vehicle. That way they'll remember that they need to get their kid out of the back seat. Uh, wear a pacifier around your neck so that as soon as you get out, if you walk into somewhere, someone is going to look at you a little odd and ask you why you have that. My favorite one, though, is take off your left shoe, put it in the back seat as soon as you get in the car. That way, when you step out, the first thing you're going to remember is your shoe and that you have a kid in the back seat. Leaving a car unattended with the AC blown does not cool the car as you may think. The car remains exposed to brutal heat outside, unlike when you are driving the vehicle. Experts warn even leaving a child in a running vehicle with AC can have detrimental effects. So it's definitely detrimental to uh, small children, any kids actually. Uh, temperatures in cars rise really quick. Uh, any change in the ambient temperature within inside a vehicle can be really detrimental to a child really fast. Uh, kids compensate really well for a long time and then just very last minute, you know, they can start showing some pretty severe signs and symptoms related to heat illness and heat injuries. Always remember, if you have a young one, to check the back seat first before you exit your vehicle. Reporting in Jackson, Jalen Anderson, 12 News.